Good morning, Jackson. How did you sleep in your big boy bed? So last night he slept in just this like this bed here. We did put some bed rails on it, but he just slept right here. And he did great. So we're headed into Nassau today. Uh, you can see we're still at sea. We are almost to Nassau though. You did drop it. But right now. Look, Jackson's got his Christmas pajamas on. And we're just waking up. There it is. There's Nassau. That's where we're headed to. The pilot has come to get us. Look at how rough the seas are for him. And we don't feel anything right now. But last night, we were rocking. So he's going to pull us in to dock. Not pull us in, but like guide us in. Well, there is a hotel. I think that's Atlantis. But we're headed in to port. Look at this little tiny lighthouse right here. You ready to eat breakfast, bud? So I thought for sure we'd be in Nassau when we woke up. No, I think that that's the idea is to like just get in right as soon as you wake up. Also, okay. side note, so unfortunately if you do not book with Disney Cruise specifically, I don't know about any other cruise lines or anything like that, but with Disney Cruise, if you do not specifically book a Disney excursion, anybody that is under the age of vac... What? Okay, I'm coming. Anybody that is under the age of vaccination, like anybody that's too young to be vaccinated, cannot go ashore. So Jackson, we didn't plan any excursions, so he can't go ashore, so we're gonna be on the boat with him. Jen and I are gonna go ashore during his nap. He's like leading me somewhere, hold on. All right, so we came up to Cabana's to eat some breakfast, and it's still the idea of a buffet, but they just loaded onto your plate for you. Good morning. Ooh, this stuff looks so good. Ham and cheese croissant, sausage muffin with like cheese all over it. Ooh, corned beef hash, grilled tomatoes. They're like all about the grilled tomatoes on this ship. Mickey waffles, bacon, eggs, sausage, hash browns, croissants, rolls, pastries. We got parfaits. We got various meats, smoked salmon, some cream cheese. Oh, and then over here we've got fruits. And then it looks like you can have them make you like some sort of cereals, cold cereals, hot cereals. Good morning. Yogurts and bananas and things like that. So here's my plate. I got the, the little sausage muffin. I got some corned beef. I got some eggs. This is a, uh, a ham and cheese croissant. Yeah, it looks pretty nice. I'm gonna get one of those. Yeah, what's broken? Your sandwich is cut in half. Oh, so that's can okay. Sandwich. I can, I don't have the other half, buddy. <laughs> And then I got some hash browns and some sausage. Jackson's just loaded up with bacon. So I wanted to show you my plate. I got one of those ham and cheese croissants, some bacon, a Mickey waffle, a grilled tomato, hash brown egg, and then I got a little parfait. This is really for Jackson, um, but it looked, it looked delicious. It had some pineapple, very tropical. And then I got stuff to make a like a lox bagel. So very exciting, very exciting morning. As we were walking out of Cabanas, I noticed they did some Christmas decorations in here on the palm trees. All right, so we are in an elevator. We're, we're headed, headed down to, to the Oceaneers Daddy. Club on deck five to go to the open house. Daddy. We'll see if Jackson can go down the slides just saying hi to everybody. So we passed by Mickey's Midship Detective Agency. So we passed by some of the interactive paintings and we're definitely gonna have to, oh, there it goes. Yeah, they're like having having this a is, battle. This is Pirates of the Caribbean. This is the, yeah. that scene. Yeah. Uh, what does he the, say? The, the goes, Wrath of Blackbeard or something like that. All right, so we're headed down to midship right now to go to go? the Oceaneers Club that way. What? Is, this is Pepe the King Prawn's room. Oh my God! I don't. We don't have our key. Oh, I wonder what happens. Anything? Oh, it's yeah. just fake. Okay. It's just a fake door. Oh, I like how it's five uh, fifty-one forty-eight and a half. Yeah. Oh, and look, there's you can call him. So maybe we'll we'll call him. Oh my gosh. Write down that phone number. 41-5148. Won't that just won't that just call 5148? Is there not a 5148? I don't know. We'll call him. If not. It is a baby one. Look, where did they go? They went deep sea fishing, they went to the beach, oh, yeah. and they went on a harbor tour. Yes. This is neat. What happens if you scan your key on it, buddy? Do you have your key? Let's see. Oh no, it does not hooked up. He's All right. Get out of here, Dad. All right, put your hands in there. It's gonna be wild. Put your hands in. You ready? In, you put them inside. You, you want, want Daddy? Daddy? Here, look. I don't even know if you can see what's going on. I'll stick my hand in this one so you can see. And it washes your hands for you. Pretty wild, right? What do you think, buddy? Chaos. And I'm sure you all have noticed that Jackson does have a little mark underneath his eye right now. 
but it's because he's wild and he fell while running around before we left for the cruise and he hit one of his toys with his head. Buddy, are you controlling his eyes? You drive an RC? Ask him to, to teach you some in, uh, some uh, you some magic. So far. Oh, those are some good games. dance. <laughs> yeah, been dancing away today. Yeah. Looks like you like cookies. I like cookies too. Oh. Yeah. We're getting some inside <laughs> info on <laughs> Doctor Strange. I can have tea and I have a little some cookies. That makes sense. Oh yeah, should we take a picture? Can you do a cool spell stance with me? Can you put your hands up just like this? Just like that. And then one arm a little bit back. Oh, like this. Put your hands up. <laughs> Perfect. Perfect. So in this area where we met Doctor Strange, they have all kinds of artifacts. Like we have the, the casket. We've got Black Panther's mask. We have Ant-Man's mask. We have, what are these, the sacred texts? Oh, this is neat. I guess you have to like interpret something here when you're at the, because we are inside the Oceaneers Club right now. Ooh, the Mystic Arts. There's like a whole Star Wars area in here. And they have like a hologram right there using the Pepper's Ghost effect. Oh, I can scan through and see different droids here. Training our child young to participate in a Star War. <laughs> You're doing great, kid. I don't think this actually does anything. I think it does. I think it interacts with each other. And there's a big one behind us that some other kids are playing at. So they have to work as a team. Oh. So like the big one says, make sure you flip the, push the flashing light. Then they push the flashing light and they, you know, control their squadron or something. Okay. So far his favorite thing in here has been RC. <laughs> also, did you see that they have some decorations up for Christmas? I did. We're inside Andy's room right now. Hello there. Yes, come on over. I, oh, is red your favorite color? Yes, is That's red your favorite color? Today. It's a juice that's gaudy in as well. No. No. <laughs> no. Where I is yours? Um, Florida. <laughs> oh, interesting. I like Florida very much. Maybe we'll make me something like this. Yes, I come to Florida sometimes. Oh wow! You know, it reminds me a little bit of Asgard because it's hot. Oh. Okay. But it's a little too humid for me. It yeah. kind of reminds me of Wakanda sometimes. Okay. Really? Yes. Oh, interesting. That makes sense. Yeah. I like it very much though because of the blue oceans. Yes, Ooh. me too. Yeah. So Asgard had beautiful oceans and it makes my eyes look a little better. Yes, oh, they're okay. the same color. Yes. I like it. What are your names? I'm Tim. Tim. I'm Jen. Jen, wonderful to meet you both. Where are you? And you're both from Florida. Yeah. yeah. Oh, wonderful. Yes. Do you go in the ocean often? We do. We do. Actually, yeah. 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 Yes. Do you like to go on the water slide upstairs? We haven't I been on it yet, yet, but we I want to. Yet. No, I am too. Oh, okay. Why not? Well, Loki does it. Loki. Oh, that, that makes sense. sense. Yeah, that makes yes. sense. It does yeah. make sense. Yes, he tends to turn up at the worst, worst times. <laughs> But if you see him, will you let me know? I will. will do, I yeah. Guess. This is pretty awesome. I don't know if it shows up on video, but this is like a game that they can play that's in 3D. So like the the X-Wing cockpit is on a separate screen than the actual game itself. It's really neat looking. This is pretty funny. This is exactly the same scene from Star Tours. They were dancing earlier and Jackson still got dancing on his mind, but they're making Making a ridiculous pizza that has whipped cream, cheese, pineapple, popcorn, chocolate chips, chocolate chip cookies, and pepperoni. You literally, literally cannot stop this kid from dancing. All right, so we are all done checking out the Oceaneers Club. Jackson really enjoyed it. He loved the, like the light up floor, just running around in circles in there, and like the Star Wars stuff he really liked. And meeting the characters, we didn't get to show you because. Uh, Jackson was out playing and then came in to meet Thor after I turned off the camera, but he got to meet Thor and he got to try to say Mjolnir or Mjolnir. Mjol. It was awesome. So now we are headed out to the splash pad. We're gonna head out to Nemo's Reef and let Jackson run amok. Should be fun. So we're switching over to the GoPro right now. All right, buddy. Here it comes. Your moment to shine. We finally found Nemo. There he is. So we found out that the aqueduct doesn't open until noon today, but this little uh, yellow slide is open right now. All right, so it turns out we cannot slide on this because it's only for ages 4 to 14. That's the under 64 inches. So, oh, look at you. You did it. 
All right, Jackson, let's see. Whoa! Whoa! Will you hold this on the way down? All right, sit down. Whoa! Come back through! Yeah! Do it again! Whoa! Alright, so we are back from the pool. We took Jackson up for a nap. So it was a great morning. He had so much fun in the splash pad. I feel like he could have gone down that slide for like 10 hours and been fine. Right? Also, he had so much fun at the open house for the Ocean Years yes, Club. he loved it. I loved right? it. I can't wait until he's old enough to actually go to the Oceaneers Club because I think he will have a blast. I think so. And now we're going to go on shore. Mm -hmm. Should be pretty fun. So we're meeting a friend on the island mm -hmm. and they said they're going to show us around a little bit. So um, I'm super excited because this is somebody who we watched his videos of the things that he did around here. Yeah. And he's kind of like, yeah, he kind of does what you do when you show like the local stuff. Right, but he's but for here. Yeah, so this is really, really neat to be able to see um, kind of what locals do. Yeah. So I'm excited for you guys to meet him. Hopefully you can check out his channel and, and see all of the cool adventures that he gets up to as well. I'll link it down below for you. Yeah, so right now we're trying to figure out how to get off the ship. We're not really sure where to go. We'll find it. There it is. There's the Disney Fantasy looking up at it. It is gigantic. So our room is like somewhere over here on deck seven. The slide's on. Oh yeah. When we get back on the ship, I'm going on that. Okay. I am doing it. Maybe. It closes at six. I'm doing it. Okay. We're going to do it at some point on this trip for sure. I, I don't want to just do it one time. Okay. I want to do it many times. Okay. Okay. <laughs> the wind is blowing me around. There it is. There's the filigree on the back of the Fantasy with Dumbo. Look at the color of the water here. It is mind-blowing. I'm so used to being at Disney that I'm like, oh, they just colored the water. No, that's the <laughs> natural color of the water. All right, we've made it onto the island. And right now we're just waiting. So when you get off the ship and you come onto the island, there's all kinds of people walking around like trying to get you in a taxi cab or take you on an hour long tour of the island or something yeah. like that. Um, and one guy came over to me and he's like, hey, Tony. And I was like, that's almost my name. Like, it's For my name's time. Tim, like yeah. it was pretty close. But I think that um, it does seem like if you're not sure what to do, I think there are lots of people who will help try to figure something out down here. Yeah. Um, I don't know if it's any of it's sanctioned by Disney. No. I think it's just this all like just locals. People on the island. Yeah. Just trying to earn a buck. And I think it's really cool just to see like what's right outside the port because we haven't gone too far. Yeah. Um, but there's a lot right outside the port. There's a lot to do. Oh yeah. All right. So we are here with Donzel and Mac, and they have a channel. It's called DZ Vision, and they're going to show us around a little bit. Yep. Welcome. Welcome to the Bahamas, guys. <laughs> oh, thank you. It's exciting. Well, so, so you guys didn't get to hear the whole spiel, but he told us so many cool things already. When I know. Got here. We've been here for like five minutes, and I feel like I know so much. Right. So we're going to go to what you guys said is like one of your favorite places. Yeah. Right? yeah. Okay. Okay. So we're going to get the real deal, like the local kind of look at everything. Yeah. I mean, we're going to take we're going to take them on the scenic route so that they can see, um, you know, a little layout of the island also. So. You know, it's gonna be fun. We can have a fun Sunday <laughs> afternoon. All right, let's do it. It's kind of like touristy stuff. You can get some drinks and coconuts. Lots of different stuff for sale in the market. So this is Parliament. This is the Bohemian Parliament. There's a statue of Queen Victoria out front of it. But this is where like all of the government workings happen, which is amazing to me. It's like right there. So this is the original straw market. This has since closed because of COVID. I, I was showing Tim and Jen that this is the this is the straw market here. But I know that you just saw um, one of the, the sites that they had to, to go to. But this is the original straw market here. And years ago it just used to be like a lot of tents and stuff, and then we had a fire that took it, that destroyed it and they decided to build a, a better structure to give it a better look a more cleanly environment and so this is where the straw vendors would be but due to covid and it being such an enclosed environment they kind of shut it down so the straw vendors had to disperse in other locations here on bay street you know just to 
be able to sell their items. But this right here is where they'll be once once uh, everything flares up. They'll go right back into this building right here. Yeah, this is this is the Pompey Museum. Um, it's a museum that gives the history of slavery in the Bahamas, and this area that it's in is known as Pompey Square. There's a restaurant here that closed down a few years ago. I don't know what they're going to put here now, if anything, is still there. And then um, up here used to be a very popular nightclub called The Balcony. This is the, the British Colonial Hilton. Hilton. Yeah. They said that it's been here forever. This is like a landmark. <laughs> they have a festival here called Junkanoo, and they dress up in all kinds of fun costumes. And they got one on display here in this window of this store. They were actually telling us about Junkanoo and how like they would do the parade. They're not doing it right now because of COVID. Um, but I'm going to link their video that we're, so you can actually see what it looks like. Oh yeah. So I'm going to link that video down below for sure so you can check it out. From what he was telling us, it sounds amazing. Sounds like a super fun time. Yeah, and like if that's what everybody's dressed like, I want to I wanna see it. And I feel like for that. Uh, we talked a little bit about the new private island that Disney bought and has been building up. It's not open yet. And I think that they have a lot of influences from Junkanoo on that island. Oh, do they? Yeah. Okay. What's it called? Lighthouse Point. Yeah. Because that was Joe Rohde's last project. And he mentioned Junkanoo a lot when he was describing it. Did yeah. So I'm interested to see what that island looks like. Just passing by Junkanoo Beach. It's like a nice little spot to stop and have a beach day. Chilling on the beach. Also, you can see the lighthouse out there that we saw on the way in. That means that the cruise ships are just kind of like right over there somewhere and this right here is the margaritaville resort kind of looks like a land cruise ship so this is where we're headed we're gonna go grab some lunch over here all right so we are just stopping off at our first little restaurant here we're on our way towards arawak key and we're not quite there yet but this is like a grouping of different restaurants and bars and if we look back you can see our cruise ship way back there that's where it is we actually can't stop here because their system is down for credit cards. So I'm going to try to find a new place or a different place. There's a lot of different restaurants and bars. They told us this whole area right here is called the Fish Fry. And we're going to go over here to Da Fish Fry Restaurant. So this is just one of the ways we make conch. Um, so um, you make the batter and you add the conch. And um, you see the, like, the sweet peppers and onions will be on the yeah. inside of that too. And then you, you deep fry it. And then it comes out in these balls here. Um, I think for you guys, you see this like if you have like a corn fritter back yeah, home. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. It looks like it, but it has conch on the inside. Okay. So this was mayonnaise, ketchup, mustard, hot sauce, and spices. Yes. Okay. And the conch fritter. Are you going to, I know you're not like, yeah, I'll try you'll it. try it? Okay, good. Yeah. So this is the inside of the conch fritter. It looks really good. This is really spicy. Yeah, it's nice. Sometimes when you get fried stuff, it can be dry. This isn't dry at all. This is really good. I like the peppers. So one thing that they were telling us is that there is a guy out back. There's just like a conch guy out back that they get the conch from. And the conchs are actually out in the ocean. Mm -hmm. And they pull them out and that's what we're eating right now. Yep. They pulled that yeah. out of the ocean like really five fresh. minutes ago. Yep. <laughs> Comes fresh. That's amazing. Comes fresh. <laughs> I just got chicken strips, uh -huh. but they are homemade, fresh mm -hmm. chicken strips. Yep. They just pulled that chicken right out of the ocean. They're just chicken of the sea. You got the filet snapper? Yeah, this looks really good. Yeah. And then you guys got the wings. What, what is that you got to? Just chicken strips. So when they set down my chicken strips, they brought out, they said, I have some sauce for you. She looked me in the eye and she said, this is hot sauce. Like as if she didn't trust me. So I feel like it might be a little spicy for me. Oh, yeah. What did you have? Snapper. A snapper. That's really good. Is it? Like so good. Nice. So fresh. And they took all the bones out of it too. Yeah, this is awesome. Mm. I think Jackson will like this. Yeah? Yeah, I'm so sad that he couldn't come today. I know. He's awake and meeting Mrs. Claus right now though, so oh. who's really winning? <laughs> <laughs> so we got a guava duff to take home. It's warm, right? Yeah, it's warm. Yeah. Oh, it that smells looks so good. so good. Wow. Oh my goodness. That look, is it like two pieces? Yes. yes. Yeah. Oh, okay. And this, oh. is, this is what I tell you about the saucy, it's all nice and soft and melted. Yeah. If you put that in the fridge, you're going to have to warm that because it's going to like, oh, it'll you be know, like when things soft. get cold, they coagulate yeah. a little. Mm -hmm. You don't want that to firm up. You want that soft like that. Okay. All right. So this is where we just ate at. It's called D Waters Restaurant. Delicious. It was Fresh. so good. It was really good. Here's what I think you should do. This is my, my proposition for you. I think you should open a tour guide company. Oh. Really? Everybody that comes here has to meet up with you so you can give them the best time. Or, or, hear me out on this, 
or you should have a YouTube channel. Oh, you do. <laughs> you have a YouTube channel where you tell people things to do on the island. Yeah. Right. When they're coming so, in here on their cruise right, ship. Right. So we, we can start there. And if you're if you're a subscriber on this channel on Tim and Jen's channel, and you're coming here for vacation, I'll give you half off on the tour. <laughs> I like it. There you go. So we'll put a link to his channel in the description <laughs> yeah. down below. We still got a little bit more to look at, yeah. and then we have to get back to the ship because Jackson just woken up. But also, you guys have to get back because they're staying at Margaritaville right now, and they have some fun stuff too. So once you check out his channel, just, you can see their Margaritaville trip. Right. right. Yeah. So I feel like it's not too far from the cruise ships. Like we walked here, but I'm sure you could get a cab over here too. So this is this is Arawak Key, and this is what they call the fish fry. So if you're looking for yeah, authentic bohemian food this is where you want to come and the restaurant that we were eating at just on the other side of these buildings here a little sign here on the side that says it is what it is sky juice and we learned that sky juice is like the, the yeah. drink of the island very popular drink <laughs> what very is it? because it consists of the coconut water mixed with sweet cream uh, some people add other little garnishes to it and then they add gin to it wonderful so as we're passing out in front of the Margaritaville Resort, so said that there's a well over here and this is Blackbeard's Well. Oh, there's just a bunch of trash down there, but they think that the pirates, like Blackbeard the pirate, would come and use this particular well to get fresh water. But we're in the glass elevator. I didn't even know this was a thing. Ooh, some pottery. Oh. Oh. What are we seeing? There's Mickey and Minnie. Oh, and they're in their winter outfits. Oh, man. Oh, geez. Anybody up here? No, nobody up here. Oh, look. Oh. Up. Russell, Doug. That's seven. Kevin. A, oh, is that bird? Kevin? No. No, it's just a bird. So the, the Princess Cruise Line that was next to us is casting off. By the way, we are back on the ship and they made us eat. We, we got some guava duff while we were out at lunch and they made us eat it before getting on the ship. This is almost like a, like a cinnamon roll, but instead of cinnamon, it's guava. Yeah, it's really good. It's like not the guava is not the sweet part. It's the, the, the cream. The cream that's the sweet part. Mm. So just so you know, if you buy fresh food, you can't bring it back on the ship with you. You can you can bring back on pre-packaged food. You just can't bring over your leftovers from lunch or whatever. Did it. All right, Jackson, you ready to have some dinner? Yeah. All right, we're going back to the same place we went yesterday. Animators tell it. Should have a different show today though, because you see everything is crush and turtles and Nemo. So we should get to talk to Crush tonight. Hopefully. Things are happening here. I feel like we're like so close to this screen. Where is he? Name is Cross. I said hello to you. Check it out. Let me hear you say Awesome. Come on in dudes. They said chop. The moonfish are going to form a shape. We have to guess what it is. Is it a bigger fish? They're, built, they're making it another fish. Is it a fish? Is it Dory? Dory! Oh. Did you get crush? Look at that. What's in there? They said it was fruit punch. Look at you, buddy. So they just arrived with our appetizers, and Tim and I both got Serrano ham with Machego cheese. And then our friend Matt got the iconic pasta percets. What is it? The black truffle black pasta percets? Champagne sauce, I think. Champagne sauce. Yeah. Whoa. We wanted to try something a little different, although those do look delicious. Food Emily? <laughs> I think so. Pasta. It's a whole wheat pasta. Oh, we ordered one of the Disney check meals for Jackson. This is the whole wheat pasta with marinara and mozzarella, and it came with a, a couple of a couple of broccoli florets and some apples. Are you having fun? Yeah. <laughs> He's so tired. He had a lot of fun today. He got to play golf. So we left the boat. Oh, it's a turtle. It's a turtle. It's a schooner. So we, we left the boat. We went out to Nassau. Jackson was here with our friend and they went golfing. They had ice cream. They watched a movie. He had like the, the best day ever. He has a little beard of pasta sauce. So I got the crusted pork. Looks pretty good. Bone in? I like it. Looks nice. What'd you get? So I got the poached yeah, shrimp awesome. salad and it's awesome. just poached shrimp, arugula, cucumber, there's some egg in there, red onion, and just a, an olive oil vinaigrette. This was on the lighter course menu. 
we had lunch when we were out on Nassau, kind of a late lunch. So I decided to do a lighter course. He crushes talking to Deborah from South Carolina right now. Oh, he is? Whoa! <laughs> what is your name? I'm Jen. Jen, nice to meet you, Jen. Jen. Is this your family? This is my family. Jen, could I take me get some intros? Oh, this is Tim. Tim, nice to meet you, dude. Nice to meet you, too. Tim. Tim. Oh, I like it. This is Jackson. Is that your offspring? It is. Hello, Jackson. Jackson! Jackson. Can you say hi? Jackson. Say you like the team we just had, didn't you? Yeah. yeah. Can you spell your name for him? So, who else do we have? This is the Matt. goggles. Hi. This is Matt. Matt? Yeah. Nice you spelled you your Matt. name. Good job, buddy. Yeah. Where are you from? We're from Orlando, Florida. From Orlando? You dudes have Mac and Waze there, dude. You do. Yeah. Is that right, Jen? Yeah, it's right. Do you surf these Mac and Waves kind of like this? Tim does. <laughs> he does? He does. So Matt, so you dudes must know how to make a wave, right? Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. Oh, so you wave, dudes. Oh Just yeah. Just throw your fins up in the air and go. Whoa! Whoa! Whoa. Put your hands on your Yeah, that was yeah. Whoa! So I was talking to my friend Deborah. Yeah. Deborah. You want to make a wave on the whole throughout yeah. the human tank. Oh, okay. Yeah. Do you think we can count on you? Yes, yes you can. <laughs> awesome. Yeah. And you'll get the rest of the dudes, all right? Okay. okay. All right, check you later. Bye. Good way, Jack. He was on our right. table the whole time. <laughs> Let's try it. Okay. Awesome. Dude. Oh, you dudes are dude. Awesome. Dude. Come on, dudes. I'm like the server. I'm going to ask you mid-bite, how's your food? <laughs> it's actually really good. Mine's really good too. Yeah. Hey, 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 hey. Jackson. Hey, we're at a nice this is this is not a Wendy's. Oh, he's very sad. <laughs> he's very tired now. So if you're looking for like a lighter dinner and they have this uh this like shrimp salad available on your on your cruise, I would recommend getting it. It's very nice. Very light. Here's a question that I have for you. Yeah. I wasn't paying enough attention last night. Okay. All of the toys that are on shelves, for the most part, are Pixar toys. Oh, okay. Were they all Pixar toys yesterday? Did they don't... change it? No, I don't think so. Okay. Just check it. Yeah. Or we're, we're, we're I feel playing. it. Yeah, I feel it. Jackson, did you like your dinner? Give him a thumbs up if you like your dinner. Ooh. <laughs> he might be a little tired because that was an old school thumbs up. <laughs> Um, what do you think of yours? I had the. We're gonna get down after. Tim had the parmesan encrusted pork chop. It was really good. It yeah. was nice. It was like sometimes pork chops can be tough. Juice. Do you want some juice? Um, Did we show that we got the special cup? Yeah, the special cup. We got the special crush cup. This this is the only night that you can purchase the crush cup. I'm this is an additional cook. charge. I think it was something. It was, it was like twelve. 12 yeah, twelve and some change, and it came with a little fruit punch. Um, but yeah, my pork was really good. Yeah. I enjoyed it a lot. So here's something that was really cute. Um, they remembered that Jackson liked raspberries, so they brought him a little bowl of raspberries. Yeah. They said, hey, we remember that you like raspberries from yesterday. Also, they cleaned our crush cup for us. Yeah, which was really awesome. I just think that the Disney cruising, you just get like a different level of service. I think so. We're saying that we've never been on another cruise. I guess you're right. So we just really enjoy the level of it. Oh, oh. So who is Tavy celebrating their first on cruise in the big old blue? Jackson. 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 Yeah, make some noise, dude. Who's Tavy celebrating a birthday? Oh. Dude, it's Rob. Birthday. Birthday. Jackson got a cookie! Everybody has to do a dance. Oh, we have to do it, okay. We have to paddle, we're paddling on the EAC. Let's do the Macarena. Oh, is it? Okay. Let's go. Paddle, paddle! <laughs> so we ordered our dessert. Yesterday we didn't order dessert. So today we had to get it. What did you get? The walnut cake with dark chocolate. Mousse, I think? Walnut cake. Is that what it was? Yeah, do you want to try somebody? Oh, it's like not a cake, it's very like fudgy. Okay. You're having huh. a cookie and you're having a, a walnut cake? 
Wow. So our friend got the, uh, this was the, the chocolate fudge cheesecake. So it was vanilla cheesecake on top of like a... Fudge base? It almost looks like a brownie. Yeah, I think it is. Yeah, it looks very nice. And then I got the deconstructed carrot cake. And this was on the no sugar dessert menu. And it looks interesting. I don't know what this is. It's like squishy. So Tim and Jackson went up to the room because um, we had a little incident where Jackson broke a cup. Um, but he, Tim asked earlier, and I don't know if, if he asked on camera, but he said, hey, wait, did the toys on the shelves change? He said, I don't remember them being Pixar. And then as we were walking out, Matt said, I think they did change. And he was saying that he thinks that this was moved up here and then whatever is behind it, whatever uh, cabinet, like whatever shelf is behind this, had different toys, different like little figurines yesterday. And today, because we saw Crush and in the, in the uh, like Finding Nemo characters, it's all Pixar. Look at that. So that's pretty cool. So now we're all done with dinner and Tim said, hey, can you guys check and see who the character in the atrium is? So we're gonna go check that right now. So Mickey and Minnie are down here in their holiday outfits. I love their little sweaters. Look at Minnie, I love her outfit. I wanna recreate this outfit. She is so adorable. I love her. So we asked and they said that Santa might make an appearance in the morning. So we are gonna try to come back in the morning and try to catch Santa. So we're walking back to the room and look at these doors. I feel like we definitely are slacking on our door presentation. They have lights and everything, man. And they have their little Christmas cards all set up and a little wreath. Okay, next cruise, we're gonna be on it. Okay, so we just came back to the room. We're in Matt's room right now and he got an elephant. How fun. They're so creative. All right, so we are all done with dinner and Jackson is asleep for the night. Mm -hmm. We're headed up to deck 11 for a character dance party. I wonder who the character, do you think it's gonna be Santa? No, I don't think he'll be doing a dance party. <laughs> but maybe, you never know. We're here for a character dance party. And right now they're doing the cha-cha slide, but I feel like I can see Mickey's ear poking out. He's dancing, he's getting warmed up. Any noise? So while Pluto is up there rocking out to the weekend, I wanted to point out a few things. For this dance party, your family is supposed to stay on one of the dots here in the center. You can kind of see everybody hanging out and dancing on their dots. <laughs> this one on the other hand, he's had a long day. Sea treasures. Do a little, a little shopping right now. Just kind of have a look around and see what they have. I love this. 
And then these are like some these, sweatpants. But they're they're pajamas, but they have Captain Mickey on them. That's super fun. I would totally get these, but the inside, although it is very soft, so hot. Oh yeah. Like I would never get to wear these. Oh yeah. And then I think this is the shirt they want me to come with it. Okay. Oh my goodness, they have a Disney Cruise Line Duffy. Amazing. So if you guys don't know who Duffy is, Duffy is Mickey's teddy bear. So you can see he's got a little hidden Mickey's on his feet. It was given to him by Minnie to keep him company on a trip that he was taking. He's dressed up for Cruise Line. This was something that I didn't realize, but each ship has their own spirit jersey. So right now we're on the Fantasy and we can buy the Disney Fantasy spirit jersey. And they have a Disney Fantasy mug too. This is the only like ship specific merch that I see at the moment. Also, I feel like this is the only Christmas thing that I'm seeing right now is this one tumbler. It kind of looks like that's it. It's a couple of ornaments here, but other than that, I'm not seeing anything else that's Christmas. Huh. So ornaments and that tumbler. Oh, there's a nutcracker over here. I feel like that counts, right? It looks like we found some more Christmas stuff. This one's kind of hard to see but it does have snowflakes in the background. It's nice. Oh yeah. Very Merry Time Cruises. Very Merry Time Cruises. I like that. Disney Cruise Line, but make it Christmas for a spirit jersey. Oh, yeah, super fun. Little ornament set. Ooh, lots of ornaments. Oh, that's super fun. Oh, it's the ship in a bottle. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. I like that a lot. Can you touch the ship? Like, is that an opening? Yeah. Oh, okay. $24.99. I like it. It's oh, plastic, glass, too. Yeah. Is it real? Yeah. You sure? Feel it. Wow, yeah. Oh, look at this one. Oh, I fun. like this one. Look at this. Oh, yeah. I like that they've started to do this. Disney sells stateroom magnets, whereas, like, everybody was just buying them on Etsy, and now Disney's like, haha, you could buy them from us. They have a specific Disney Cruise Line pirate themed spirit jersey. The little skulls and the Disney Cruise Line logo looks like the pirates of the caribbean font and then on the front i like that it's like the puffy paint oh yeah yeah and then on the front kind of like an anchor around the disney cruise line logo and it's got this like lacing on it too oh yeah that'd be fun could you imagine if he was just like a little tiny pirate that's, yeah the, oh i like this the funnel cup that's fun look at the shot glass where is it oh right here <laughs> Another thing though is that over at Artist Palette, which is oh, where we ate, we gotta get there's a big deal about the butter knives. People were taking them. Oh, they so were? They, yeah, so they, so they started selling them. You know what's funny is Jackson loves this. He right? was just he just wanted to hold it. He was just like holding it and eating his dinner. So, so what a fun and fantastic day today was. Mm -hmm. It was really good. There was so, we packed so many things into this day. Right? <laughs> it doesn't even feel like this morning was the same day. Right. Because we did so many things. That's the thing about going on a Disney cruise. There's just like so much to do. Yeah. I, we also ate a lot. Too much. We right? ate too much. But I also feel like even though we're doing so much, I honestly still feel like we're missing a lot. Right. So hopefully on our day at sea, we'll get to do all of the things that I feel like we've been missing. Right. So be sure to check out DZ Vision in the description down below. With that being said, we are off. We'll see you all tomorrow. Hey, this is Donzel. And this is Mac. From DZ Vision in the Bahamas. And now it's time to pay the price.